Hey, yo, 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 y'all already know what it is, man. This your boy, Porter Rich, man. I'm here with Gully TV. They live in Camden City, New Jersey. And it ain't too much more to talk about, man. We out here late night, too. We out here late night. We keeping it super gully. You know, the whole avenue is still lit. It's still active. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers are still running around. The hustlers are still hustling. You know, the motherfucking lurkers are still lurking. And we out here still working, man. So shout yep. out to Gully TV. Shout out to myself, Porter Rich. Shout out to my whole, my whole squadron, ITD Records, ITD family. Yeah. And y'all already know what it is, man. We closing out one year, going into a next 2019, 2020. We about to motherfucking go. Yeah. I'm about the Crown Rulers, legendary group from out here, man. Kick the ball. That's, yeah, Crown Rulers. That's, that's a record I grew up on. Yeah, shit. Crown Rulers had kicked the ball. Shout to um, shout to Grand Poo. You know what I'm saying? Grand Poo. We was in the cow. I think me and Grand Poo was in like the county together at one point. We're like we was, you know, just chopping it up about linking up on the streets when we get out. You know, just chopping it up, seeing what we could do. Did Whatever. you know who you knew who he, who he was? Before that, no. Before that, I didn't know. When the record like took off, and at the time when the record was sizzling and all that shit, yeah, we was I, young, yeah. I was a young cat, yeah. Right. So I ain't, I ain't know at that time. But later on, when I started doing like my thing, and you know those records was like resurfacing, and they were saying like, you know, this is like some of the first records. Like I was definitely like familiar with like who he was. You know, right. we had met. I got familiar, and just a lot of history before like, before like even like Grand Poob and them kicked the ball. You had like, uh, I go Rambo, you know what I mean? Rapping scratch niggas like that. Some people ain't even familiar with that history because that shit go back a little bit before niggas' time. Right. But they was around. They had shit. If you go to YouTube, you'll pull, you, you'll pull that shit up on YouTube right now. Rapping scratch, I go Rambo. That was one of the first records that was on like radio, like as far as like Philly radio. Right. I don't know exactly what the radio station was, if it was 599 or if it was something for that. But that was one of the first joints. And you know, Rapper Scratch still around now. He around now, he in the field. You'll run up, you'll run up on Rapper Scratch late night like the night. He'll run up on you and you know, show love if you know who he is and if you're familiar. Right. So we got history, man. We got history and it's just about you know, grinding, man, grinding, man. If it ain't, if it ain't me, if it ain't Porter Rich, it's gonna motherfucking tear the doors down. It's gonna be somebody after me, you know. And shout out to all the young niggas that's grinding and it's coming up now and trying to do their things now. Like we gonna keep hustling, we hustling. Simple shit. Really appreciate you having me down here, man. Uh, and I really appreciate you running through that history about the Crown Rulers. Cause I'm, I'm, I'm a purist when it comes to the hip hop shit. Right. People be needing to know about that. Right. If there was a misconception, like when, when some people heard the, the record became popular in Philly, so people tend to think that they might have been from Philadelphia. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's because Philly's so close, man. We had times with Philly, even with like the Tough Crew shit. Tough Crew niggas, when Tough Crew niggas, you know, Tough Crew was from Philly. And Tough Crew, you had niggas in Tough Crew rapping about like Camden areas, you know what I mean? When they was mentioning like 3 2 and shit like that. So a lot of times people used to think like, oh, Tough Crew from, was from Camden and Philly or whatever the case. Just so close, man, motherfuckers. You know, Philly and Camden, it ain't too hard to get that shit. Yeah, that shit. Oh, we always we always get that confused and shout to Philly, man. It's all love. Shout out to Philly, though, man. Shout out all my Philly niggas, though. For real, yeah. for real, man. We deal with the same shit, man. It's all love, right, man. man. We grinding and we all trying to make a motherfucking way, man. It's the same shit over here. I think a lot of I think a lot of times, like I said, it's just it's small over here. So Camden, we have a hard time. We have like, you know, a harder time like just getting, you know, the exposure that we need and getting ourselves out there like we need to get ourselves out there because it's just smaller, bro. It's coming though. It's coming though, man. Niggas is grinding, man. Niggas is working, man. Like I said though, man. 
can to gotta support Canada, bro. We gotta support the city, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Stop, like, you know what I mean? All the goofy all the shit, niggas hating on niggas, niggas hating on each other, you know what I'm saying? The street shit is one part. It's, it's, it's one thing. Music hey, thing is another people, thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Niggas support, man. You feel me? Niggas support, man. Niggas support, man. Let's kick the fuck up, man. Let's put the city on the map. I want my nigga to say something one time. Come on, come and say something one time. One time. My niggas don't, you know what I mean? My homie Porter. Real niggas here. He don't even, he don't even, he don't even do shit like this. But he'll do it for me, though. <laughs> My homie. He'll do it for me, though. It's here. Sam D. Hold up. What's up? I, listen. I love mine, man. I love mine. I wouldn't trade nothing in for, for nothing. You understand what I'm saying? Like, you can leave us here for eternity. We gonna eat, man. We gonna eat. We gonna be fine, my nigga. Because, like, it's home. It's home. We was born here. We was raised here. We always did right here. So we always, we always get right here. You know what I'm saying? We don't talk crazy. Man, we out here, man. Listen, we live. Shout out to Gully TV.